Hey, fellas. How about a little music, eh? You cats keep beating up your chops? I ought to turn you over to the cops. But dig this spiel, I'm gonna lay on your gate. Don't cop your broom, park the body and wait. You run your mouth and I run my business, brother. You run your mouth and I run my business, brother. Buongiorno. Join the mob again in Take Two's long-awaited sequel, Mafia 2. This time we step into the shoes of the young gangster, Vito Scaletta, who just came back from World War II in Italy. He's poor, eager to earn some money, and he doesn't care about breaking the law in any form. You start in telling me you my pal. And end up telling me how to handle my gal. You run your mouth and I run my business. All right, we're here. Right from the beginning, it's clear that Mafia 2 is all about the cinematic experience, even more so than the original Mafia and Rockstar's Grand Theft Auto 4. There are so many cutscenes that you'll probably feel like you're taking part in a Martin Scorsese classic, such as Goodfellas or Casino, rather than just playing a free roam action game. Fortunately, this movie is excellent enough to make even Scorsese proud. Look, asshole, I'm not in the mood. Why don't you get out of my face before you get hurt? Ah, no can do, pal. Derek wants his money. Derek can kiss my ass. What's that fat fuck gonna do? Have me killed? Hey, you said it, not me. Why don't you give it a try then, asshole? Mafia 2 is, of course, very similar to the Grand Theft Auto games. The major difference being the arrow represented and Boy, the 50s looks absolutely awesome in this game. The buildings, streets, posters, radios, the clothing, everything is a solid reflection of 1950s America. We checked out the PC version of the game, but also tried the PS3 and Xbox demos. Each version had their own graphics device, but if you're gonna go with the PC version, you have to push everything to the max. With Nvidia's physics technology turned on, the game looked incredible, but without, the graphics were not as ugly less impressive. But enough about the graphics, what about the game itself? Some kind of circle jerk? Alright, come on, Scaletta. You gotta visit. We got them all! Stop shooting that fucking thing! I'm going deaf over here! Compared to Rockstar's classic, Grand Theft Auto 4, the gameplay is more linear. Instead of choosing between different mob leaders, Vito is always told what to do and where to go. The variety is rather in the missions, instead of the usual go there, kill this, rob that, we must take part in a variety of gangster activities, like selling illegal gas stamps to gas station owners or stolen cigarette cartons. What you selling, Mac? You buying or just window shopping? Maybe. We're selling smokes. Two bucks a carton, hundred bucks a crate. I'll make you a deal. You fuck over ten cartons and maybe we'll let you and your buddy get out of here in one piece. Since Vito begins at the bottom of the gangster's hierarchy, sometimes his task will be a bit humiliating and it will take a while for him to climb up the food chain. Okay, now who's gonna bury him? What? I, I give me a minute to get a hold of myself. Can you just do it? Every time I get a whiff of the guy makes me have to puke. And Eddie's not gonna be any oh, help here. In some ways, Mafia 2 is more realistic than Grand Theft. Vito has to obey the law, taking care not to hit other cars, or even flashing his gun in public for fear of being chased by the cops. So much you've got me disgusted, but you run your mouth and I run my business, brother. You run your mouth and I run my business, brother. The combat is also very realistic, not to mention bloody and lots of fun, and the cover system and weapon handling is superb and believable. The only aspect of the game that falls short of the realism in Grand Theft is the behavior of the citizens in Empire Bay. They walk the streets, they read the daily news, but overall they are just less lifelike than Liberty City. But you'll only notice all of this if you're a nitpicker. Step on it, Vito! He's getting away! I got it for Joe. This thing won't go any when you break it down, Mafia 2 is a very impressive and enjoyable gangster game. It has great fighting sequences, gorgeous graphics, and a tiling story that's nicely complemented with cinematic cutscenes. It won't be long before you find yourself a part of the mob, proving to your gangster buddies that crime does indeed pay. We give Take-Two's latest representation of the Mafia an 8.8 .8 out of 10. 
This looks interesting. Want to make a small bet? If you'd like to play this game, you can buy it on our website or even win it well for auctions. Also check out our Mafia 2 wallpaper at gladria.com. Thanks for watching. Arrivederci. I'll see you later.